What's up guys, Steve we're scotching things. Hey, sorry, uh, I'm in my garage. My One of my work lights above me burned out. Didn't, I don't have anything to replace it. Don't have my tripod, I thought I'd just do this by hand. I'm gonna talk work boots real quick. I know that's not what we usually talk about, but two and a half years ago, I switched to these Timberland Ag Boss. Um, from the gym, the Justin Commander X5s, and I did videos on those. The Commander X5s I'd worn for like five or six years and found like the build quality had just gone down on them. And I tried these Timberlands on and they were the most comfortable boot I have ever worn. And I still stand by that two and a half years. Two and a half years and I finally, I mean, they've, they've done their job. Um, but they're wearing out like the leather just starts to stretch you can see and your foot starts to slide over the wet leather is just old I'm going to keep them for a backup pair and I said I would never wear anything other than these again, but I Went with hold on real quick. and I'll tell you why so I went with this Tony Lama um, I don't know a whole ton about boots but I think these have been around, I think, for a while. You know, and I had lots of suggestions. Um, guys gave me lots of suggestions in that last video a couple years ago on Ariat, on Twisted X. Um, I, I just go with what I know. And like I said, I, I said I would never wear anything but these again. But I live in a small town. Um, my days off are kind of coveted. And I didn't have time, so I had, I do have a small store in town that sells workwear. Um, but they don't have these. They said they could order them in from their bigger store, which is where I got them. I just didn't have, you know, two and a half hours or just two hours drive time. And then how much time would take in the store. Um... So I spent some time because each what I found with like work boots like this, these pull-ons, every time I go to get a pair, the sizing's different. Um, it could be a half size. Like I tried on where is this? What size is this? Hold on one second. Um, those are it's weird. These are nine and a halfs. Um, I wear like an eleven and a half shoe anywhere from. You know, it depends on the brand. I can wear from 11 to 12. Um, I found in these, I buy them a little snugger because they do break in and stretch a little. But it's weird how, like, a nine and a half feels fine in these. But, like, I can't fit my, like, I just bought a pair, a new pair of Nikes last week. And I went down to a 10 and a half because that was the only size they had. And they're really tight, guys. I mean, like, really like an 11 and a half would have been better. I don't know. I don't get the sizing. But like I said, I didn't have time to dedicate two hours worth of drive time. So I spent some time in the shop, tried on what they had. They had a pair of Red Wings and I just wasn't, I, I like the Red Wing pull-ons. Comfort's a big deal, guys. When you're on your feet for 12 hours a day, Comfort is a big deal. Uh, I like pull-on because laces break. It's just easy in the morning, you know. You're not dealing with laces coming untied. Um, I like the look of the square toe. That's just me. So these are the TLX. What are, well, I don't even know what brand. What the, like I said, Tony Lama. I don't know a whole lot. What is this? This is the Force Dark Brown uh, Retain Leather. 11 inch men's waterproof H square with the composite toe. Shank, non metallic, some dry lux. Uh, so the upper is blue cowhide, vamp, dark brown. The removable ortho, you know, ortho dry lux must be there. What they call their tra their uh, technology for inside, um, but it is, you know, looks com it's very comfortable. Most comfortable boot I like. We'll see how this wears. Like in a lot of boots right here, the Justins break down here in a in a month. I started getting um, 
this heel breaking down. So we will see how these, and these were considerably cheaper um, than, than the Ag Boss. But I tried on the Ariats. I couldn't really find a pair I liked. I tried on some twists. I just couldn't find and I was like, okay, I'm going to have to drive. Then I threw these on real quick, not really knowing. I've seen seen them before. Tried them on. I was I was happy with how comfortable they were. We will see. Um, and light. Light is like, these things were much lighter than my old Justins. These are about the same. TLX, I don't know what that, Tony Lama X, I don't know. Claim they're waterproof. Nothing's really waterproof, we'll see. Um, like I said, we'll we'll see how they are, and I'll try and be better on reporting, non-marking sole. That doesn't really matter to me. Slip resistance, oil res So we'll, we'll just see how they are. Um, like I said, my biggest concern is I don't care how they, like, they don't need the last two years. Like, I, that was just, I think, a fluke. Um, but my concern is that, like, the Justins on this heel cup back here start to break down where that just uh that just kind of wears on your achilles um and you know if you get anything back there oh god it's a pain it just hurts so yeah hopefully these will be uh comfortable i'll let you know like i'm you know i don't want to go pissing money away on boots but i was willing to give these a chance even though i uh, sorry there cut the tag off I was willing to give those a chance, even though I said I would never wear anything other than the Ag Bosses again. So, made in Vietnam. So, yeah, there you go, guys. But I do like the Ag Boss. Even though these things are just beat, I will keep these as my backup boots and throw away my old pair of backup boots. So, I don't really need a back there. It's just like an emergency. If something were to happen catastrophic, then... I have something just to protect my feet real quick. So not something usual. Like I said, we'll see how these, not a usual video for me. We'll just kind of see how these things go. But good looking boot. I mean, I'm not into Western wear, but I just find for me, like these are just a way, way better um, boot than something with laces. So thanks for watching guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.